Oh, jeez. Gonna start off strong today with some crazy cutscenes. Tushu, have you noticed? Power of nature's gathering your farm. So loud. Beanstalk, let's climb it. Sure! What the heck? I feel like this, is com this reminds me of Rune Factory now. What is happening? Navi sh Sprite, it's been too long. Sky Sprite, I miss you, friend. <laughs> the nature is so great. Grew a beanstalk. First time we have a human up here. Beanstalk Island. Special sky location buried in a sea of clouds. A bright colored sky sprite. We'll play mini games with you here. Want to play digging for sprites? Here rules. Don't dig up beanstalks. Okay. Well, that's super easy. Wait, can I use my charge ability? No. I don't think I can use my charge ability. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, yeah. This is, uh... Interesting, interesting. everyone, right? Ooh. Uh. Shit. Nah. Uh. Which one did I miss? messing up. I was trying to go right to the ones where they were so that I can kind of mark around them. If that makes sense. Nope. This is interesting uh, <laughs> mini game. I don't know what's going on. I like Star Wars, I hate going in there. Uh, I can't know if there's one down here in this corner. I don't think there was, but... High score bonus. Your maximum is increased. All right, sprite coins. Eight a.m. Wait. So what time is it after this? What even is this minigame? I don't know, dude. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> uh. 
So I'm just doing it where I'm marking them. The ones be one below are, are marked. So this should be a good strategy to do this consistently. Oh, until I... Okay, so that one there. And then that one. Yeah. Oh, I forgot that one. Or, oh, I see. That is kind of not the best strategy then. Dang. I kind of messed up a bit. Oh my god. <sighs> Shit. One here? Yeah. Uh, there's one, one more, and then I think there's one there. There's none on this level, I think. You can see movement, too. That means there's a sprite there. That kind of helps as well. Fuck. I think there's another one on this level here. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. And now it's 9 a.m., so that took an hour. What a weird island. Okay. Huh. It's up paradoxical. Paradoxical. Like the English version, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I actually set up YouTube memberships. Um, so this is more of a YouTube thing, I suppose, than a Twitch thing, because why would you join YouTube membership if you're a Twitch sub? It just makes more sense to be a Twitch sub, but it's kind of the same thing except for people on YouTube, so for people that want it, I got that. So, I think uh, right now I only have four emotes, but you get emotes, same as Twitch basically, for live streams. Like, I don't live stream on YouTube, right? But in the comments, you can actually use the emotes too. And you also get like a badge and stuff in the comments. That's pretty cool. Um, and I added some other things, like, you can watch the videos early. Um,. I made it so YouTube members can be a part of like the sub tub discord, which would normally just be for Twitch subs. Uh, and there's like one other main thing that I'm blanking on right now. But yeah. Uh, I was thinking of have it, having it make an alert on the stream, but I don't know the legality of that actually. Because it's like kind of, I mean, that <laughs> I, I basically be like promoting like YouTube memberships on Twitch in a way, you know? Because like, thanks for the YouTube membership. I'm just like totally comfortable just talking about it, obviously. But like having an alert show up on the screen, I'm not sure if you would get in trouble for that or not. I actually don't know. And I don't know of anyone that does that. That. And. Yeah, I've never seen someone do that, so I don't know how that works. So I'll just keep that off of Twitch. Basically. But I'm excited. We'll see. I think there'll be a lot of people that watch the videos on YouTube that want to support. Uh, yeah. Oh boy. We got a lot of stuff to pick up. Yeah, if you want to be a member... I just made it... You, I can actually make it any price. At first, I was gonna do like a cheap, like a really cheap, like a like two ninety nine or like one ninety nine price, and then like a five ninety nine and like a ten ninety nine. And I decided, you know what? Instead of having all these tiers, I'm just gonna make it just one tier, five bucks. That's it, you know, clean and simple. Um, so yeah. 
you want to be a part of that, just whenever you're on one of my YouTube videos, right next to the subscribe button, there's a join button. And, uh, yeah. We'll see how that goes. Any more space? Gonna need more silver. Alright, and if picking up where we left off yesterday, we're trying to get more supple, whatever. The YouTube live stream stuff isn't too bad these days. Yeah, honestly, honestly, Sam, it would be cool to do one because I feel like I would get really good viewership. One, because I feel like the there would be a decent exposure on that platform. And also because I have enough subscribers now that I feel like, I don't know, I... <laughs> I would not, let's just say this, I would not be surprised if I got the same amount of viewership on YouTube as I did on Twitch. I like Twitch though, but, but yeah, I don't, I don't know the rules of if I can do streams on YouTube or not with my contract to Twitch. I know obviously I can't stream to both and I wouldn't want to stream to both at the same time. Too messy, too much. I want people to go over to my Twitch that watch on YouTube. But, what's, is there, I, I don't know, is there something from, I think there's something from Stop Me from just doing a YouTube stream in general. I know, if it's entirely different content, like, for example, on Pickleball TV, if I did a live stream, obviously that's fine. Completely different business brand, everything. Like, I can obviously do a live stream. They don't, they don't hold my, my my life or my you know everything about me they just the contract is just for tushi content but i think so i think that means i can't do a youtube live stream even if i'm not streaming on twitch i know as a, as a uh, affiliate you can An affiliate you you're not supposed to stream to like both the sites at the same time but you can stream you know gaming content to youtube and gaming content to twitch separately like, like different time, like the different streams, not the same stream. Uh, wait, we want to bring all this stuff to the museum, actually. That's why I had it in my inventory. Um, yeah. Stream to both at the same time. Yeah, no, we can't, I can't do that. My fourth an email. No, yeah, I definitely, I definitely cannot do that. I cannot do that. Because of my contract with Twitch. Unless something has changed, but I highly, 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 highly doubt it. And that's fine, because it gets messy. I want everything to be in one spot. I don't want to be talking to different chats and stuff like that. Seems like most I see that do both YouTube and Twitch is like, follow me over Twitch for more views. Yeah. Basically what I'm saying, I kind of like the idea of one of these days doing a stream on YouTube literally just to, to I play Stardew and I would just be like, hey, like if you guys want to see more, I'm on Twitch. Just kind of like use it to push people to another platform kind of <laughs> to promote myself. But uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure I can even do that. Mixer doesn't exist anymore. Can you stream on YouTube with Twitch affiliate? Yes. Twitch affiliate signing exclusive content means any content streamed on Twitch cannot be shown on another platform for at least 24 hours. Right. 
But the partner contract, I'm not sure how different that is. I'd have to contact someone, basically. Rip mixer. <laughs> Actually, it's a pretty it's a pretty common question though. I bet maybe the answer is out there for partners as well, just because there's so many partners now. Oh. You can only live stream game early content to it. See that that's the one. That's the one. Recorded clips, fine on YouTube. You can broadcast your music reviews anywhere you want. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, live stream is live stream. But like I said, gaming related content, like obviously I can I can stream, uh... Oh. Pickleball TV. You know, they don't... Oh. Twitch doesn't hold me hostage for completely different brands and things. <laughs> You know what? I wonder if I could do if I if I can do streams that are not game related though then. Like for example, I mean game related is kind of a broad scope though, but once if I do Stardew Valley board game stream on YouTube. The thing is it just helps Twitch anyway. All I'm trying to do is just promote my Twitch basically on YouTube, <laughs> you know? Ugh. I, I don't know, I'd be curious and it'd be fun to do a stream on YouTube just to see what kind of viewership I would get. Tushi Cooks on YouTube. Yeah, I could do Tushi Cooks. Thing is like, the, I don't know if a lot of people want to see, like, I know I get more viewership doing Tushi Cooks on Twitch than I would YouTube because on Twitch it's a lot of people following me for my personality and whatever I play, but on YouTube it's a lot of people following me for starting. So, you know, it doesn't, it's kind of the inverse in terms of which be good for which. Like a Stardew Valley board game stream on YouTube would do well and that's not technically gaming. I mean, board game is a game though, I don't know. Um, the IRL streams, but Hello. the contract seems weird, weirdly wrote. Yeah. Are there any reports I'm getting threatened or banned? No. Not that I know of. Yeah, it's kind of just there. Twerks on YouTube. <laughs> Twerks. <laughs> oh my god. Gaming content is Twitch intellectual intellectual property. Mm. Hello. It's their property, huh? I own you! Which recently switched last year on Twitch and YouTube at the same time. Right. But the thing is, for something like that, that big, they can talk to Twitch directly and just give them a ultimatum, basically. Like, hey, either it's, you got two options. We stream to YouTube and that's it. You get nothing. Or we stream to YouTube and Twitch at the same time. That's it. What do you want? Do you want just YouTube? Or do you want YouTube and Twitch? Twitch is like, fuck you. All right, sure. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 
cloth. Both cloths. Interesting. Very interesting. Renown Mount Miner. Bean. Beanstalk Island for the first time. I wouldn't become a partner on Twitch. I think it would probably find something that works for you. Yeah. Maybe. I could just talk to my I could talk to my partner contact and see what I can do. It does seem weird to me that they can legally say, you know, we hold all rights to anything when you play games. It's kind of kind of weird. And it's just not it's not even actually true to an extent. Like there's there's definitely loopholes to that. Like what happens if, you know, there's some Stardew Valley tournament and they're streaming on YouTube only and I'm a part of it. They're going to say you can't be in it like Or like, I don't know. There's just weirdness to it. Like I said, is a board game fine? That's not video games. It says gaming, not video games. Board games is not like a, I don't know. It's just weird. It's your content. Yeah, but, mm. Well, what happens if I make something that isn't my content then? What happens if I make a YouTube stream that's like... I'm putting on my channel and it's Stardew, so it's gaming. But it's like... Not just me, it's like... Bigger than me. I, I like... Once if I make a Stardew tournament... Make my own Stardew tournament. And then... There's other people in it as well, not just me. I would like to get silver. We already have everything silver, basically. Hmm. Watering can? We don't really need a watering can, though, because we can just get more sprinklers. Yeah, we should just get more sprinklers. We should, we should get ready to just get a bunch of sprinklers, and then just mass in summer. That'd be cool. I know- I know we're waiting on six more supple lumber. Oh wait, how many silver? I think we need ten silver ingots too. And we're pretty close actually right now. Very interesting. I wouldn't risk it. Yeah, exactly. Like maybe I'd risk it if I wasn't like daily streaming on Twitch, but like that's kind of my thing, you know? So it's kind of... I don't know. Did I get two milk from that? Dang. That's so cute. You calling a Rosa cute? Hehe. <laughs> <laughs> uh wait, how long until the wood is done? 
it's pretty close. Be a commentator commentating the tourney. That'd be a lot. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's kind of what I'm getting at. Like, what would it take? That's what I'm just thinking it outside of the box, yeah. I actually found your Twitch through YouTube Let's Plays. So I'm proofing exposure. Oh yeah, no, that's the thing. I know. Honestly, I'm pretty sure I would. I would not be surprised if it's like at least 80 to 90 percent of my exposure right now. And honestly, it would probably be even higher than that if it wasn't for the fact that I've gotten some pretty big raids in the last couple months playing Stardew, I'm like Little Simsy and a few others. So yeah. No, YouTube is like the whole reason I'm doing well. They don't enforce the rules you're up. Well, yeah, but that, I don't. I don't want to skirt around the. I don't want to break the rules regardless. But. So, uh, update on what I'm thinking about doing for a living. I'm planning on... We're gonna go month to month, and I think I'm gonna stay here for an extra month or two. Um, at least to get through... At least stay here through June, because I'm not even gonna be here very much, so... I'd rather pay less rent. I'm not even gonna be here, like, almost at all. So I'm just gonna be traveling for, like... Three out of the four weeks of June, or more. I'm being me home for like four or five days at a time max, so it doesn't make sense to move during that time. Especially if I'm gonna be paying more money, which I would be if I was gonna move to San Diego area. So, but I think so. Basically, I think the earliest I move would be in July, but the latest I move would be in like September first or something. Um, like in that kind of range. Um, and I think, uh, I've talked to my dad, and I've talked to, uh, my friends that live in San Diego, and they said that they'll help me, uh, uh, they'll show me around and stuff when I'm, when I'm in there, when I'm there in June, so we can do, like, a reconnaissance trip to see where I want to live and stuff. And also that there might even, they'll keep their eyes open for someone that wants to, uh, get a roommate. The, my friends that own the pickleball club, basically, so they know everyone in pickleball in the area. So if there's anyone that wants to room with someone, plays pickleball, then he'll let me know, basically. That's cool. And then again, since I'm going month to month, I'll have lots of time to figure out uh, exactly when I'm gonna. You know, I, I won't be rushing, basically. Um, and also, the summers in Portland are amazing. They're, they're beautiful, so I could stay here. And then, once it hits September, or I guess, like, at the latest, like, October, when it starts to, it's gonna start getting rainy, then I can say PEACE! And go into the... nice weather there. That's my plan. I think it's a good plan. Oh wait, no, we need the silver.
Yes, hearts are energy. Yep, it's stamina. Yes. From one to Stardew. Stardew's a 10. One is the worst game I've ever played. This is like a eight right now or an eight and a half. Somewhere in there. <clears throat> Alright, so we're gonna go to sleep. And then uh, we're gonna be mining today. In the new mine. Should be it should have gold there, hopefully. Love Stardew, but it's a 10. Yeah, Stardew's a 10 out of 10. It's a 10 out of 10 for uh, for anything in this genre. I mean, name it. I mean, it, you know, it's like uh, uh, if you have a, a certain genre of game, it's very specific and niche. I mean, the best game in that genre, unless it's just still bad, then you'd get like a 10, basically, because that's the best that that genre has to offer. I mean... You know? I saw with 50 months, what up? Thank you. Oh, I have more hearts now. Oh shit, I have more hearts because of that mini game I did. Nice. Thank you, Ice over the 50 months. Appreciate that. Put up. Oh, stable. Need more solid lumber and lumber. Let me get a horse. And floor went well. Yeah, it was good. It was good. Look fun to watch. Don't really like to play them. The board game looks amazing. Yeah. Uh, ah, here it is. Please tell me I have this stuff. Yes, that's what I need. These mushrooms on the other side look like oyster mushrooms. Oh, I bet it. I bet this take till tomorrow. Yeah. Dang it. I should have done this last night. What was I thinking? All right, we have one more day. One more day. Uh. Okay. Um, I was being dumb. <laughs> Cried too much as a baby? What? Discussion question, wouldn't call it a 10. I would. Where's that? Alpaca. Kill it! This argument isn't a 10 because on release it wasn't perfect. Oh, who cares about release? We're not talking about release. Also, I mean... On release, it... Was really good. They just added more stuff. So they just added more stuff. Herbal log. What are these? Oh my god. <laughs> Tur 
Character depth and dialogue sense release? Not really. They added- he's added... What? Two more marriageable candidates. Which was already plenty. And then... One more cutscene with each? Or is it two? One. End game for Penny. Why are you saying Penny? I mean, every character got one new cutscene. Uh. I don't know. I, I disagree with you. I don't know. But even if, even so, like, who cares? Like, we're not talking about... We're talking about Stardew right now, not Stardew five years ago. <laughs> Alright, so I guess being able to buy a house with Penny's mom makes it a 10 out of 10 for you, but without it, it doesn't? Like, I don't know. <laughs> If anything, the fact that the game has just had all these updates since then is, is is more of a supporting factor that it's a 10 out of 10. Which is what you kind of were saying, that it's had all these free updates. But, I don't know. Anyway. Moving on. Uh... Saturday. paid DLC. I don't mind it. Depends on the game. I think DLC has more of a bad rap now because the, a lot of the DLC is already done by the time they release it. It's just to get more money out of a game. But, you know, it doesn't mean that paid DLC is bad. I mean, not at all even. I don't know. Depends on the game. Sometimes it's abused. Gives paid DLC a bad rap. Even if Concerned Date made the updates paid. Well, I mean, some of them, I guess, would be weird if they were paid because they're more just quality of life stuff, but... If, for example, you made the update with the island a paid DLC, I mean, it It'd be bad to be respectable. I mean, he put in work to do that and hired people to help him do it too and stuff. Like, but I mean, concerned, you know, everyone. I mean, I love Concerned Dave just as much as the next person, but you also have to keep in mind that, like, if if we're comparing to like a small indie developer, like, he was, he's a small indie developer, but he's been very fortunate that it has done very well. So he has the ability to do free updates. He didn't need to. He easily could have paid, you know, had people pay for more. It's really cool that he made them all free. But what I'm saying is, imagine there for one concerned date that has, you know, extremely gifted, made that great game, and it did extremely well. So he had he has the option to make them all free. There are thousands for every one of him. There's thousands of these indie developers that are scraping by, and and people are begging them for more content. It's like, well, I mean, crunching the numbers. They can't do it unless they make it paid. So, um, you know, as long as as long as they do a good job and and uh, you know it's worth it. You know, as long as they don't 
make it so you overpay and then they underdeliver, like, then, no, I think pay DLC has a place. I mean, he didn't have that. I think, yeah, for sure, and he, he definitely could have made it pay, which is which is which is good. But I guess I guess what I'm trying to get at is like. If if just because another developer doesn't do the same thing Concerned Ape does doesn't make them like a stingy developer or something. You know what I mean? Could have retired might have done that. <laughs> you think about someone that puts puts that much effort into doing something they love to make a game like Stardew. Why would they ever, you know, fully retire? Like, it, it's... I don't know. Not that I want to compare him to me, but, like, I put a lot of hours into streaming and stuff. Because I love it. It's not because I'm trying to grind here. I'm trying to grind to make as much money as possible so that I can retire and get the hell out of here. So I don't have to see you guys again and don't have to play video games on stream. <laughs> like, it's not it at all. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> I feel like it'd be similar with Concerned Ape, like, it, I mean, with a lot of people, really. Like, retiring, like, you get so bored, you're doing nothing. You'd have, like, a great month or two of, like, wow, this is crazy, I don't have to do anything, and then, in, and not even a month, for me, it'd take, like, a week, and I'd be like, oh my god, I gotta start, I'm gonna start up another YouTube channel or something, I'm gonna start making content. <laughs> Anyway. Granted, I think half of my actual hours in Stardew is because I paused and walked away. Because you can't just save whenever. <laughs> like 200 hours. Got it in February. So much time in it. Surprised me so much. I had no idea. Such a comfort game. Yeah. Uh. Okay. What else do we got? Honestly, get so much good of the game. I'd be happy, more than happy, slapping another five dollars for the island DLC. Yeah, exactly. I, I a lot of people have said that, but I mean, he just just hasn't been the need. I think there's specifically he he said too that um, he's he if he makes not if like when he makes another game, he what he's not gonna have it free. Like you have to pay for it. So like he he said like if you want to support, just wait till my next game and then you can buy that. <laughs> It's not a hobby, it's a side job. Successful. Well, yeah, no hobby in the sense that, you know, if you're gonna work that hard to do something, obviously enjoy it to some extent. But I don't know, it's just the it's just the how you define the word. I mean I guess hobby does kind of make it sound like you Yeah, I don't know. They may buy a lot of to I know. That's what that's all I'm trying that's what I'm trying to say. I'm trying to say the same thing, Rad. I'm trying to say that if you put all that effort into something, like you're that much of a go-getter with working, you're not gonna just wanna retire. Like you're not just gonna wanna just not do anything. You you go crazy. That's all that's what I was trying to say. I don't know what they were trying to say. Uh I'm forgetting what I'm doing. Oh yeah, I want to make sprinkler. In between, that'd be nice. Not worry about finances. I think that's where he's at. I don't know, it feels weird talking for him. I should talk for Eric. <laughs> that's where I'm at, I feel, kind of. Like, I don't have to worry about finances too much, so... I mean, I did just a few months ago, but now I'm chilling, so... I'll have to worry about him again in the future at some point, but right now, it's like... Just keep streaming. And, uh... I don't feel the pressure 
But at the same time, I, I want to spend my time streaming. It's not like I don't want to, so here I am. <laughs> Get rid of this guy. I can't hold these two spots. Is that yeah. Uh Is that your actual schedule? Yeah, but I haven't been sticking to it. It's been a rough, it's basically been like a rough guide and I have not been following it closely. Like today I was supposed to start at two and I start till 4.30, it's two and a half hours late. <laughs> I would like to follow it closely. That's kind of the, that's the idea, but I haven't been. So, I don't know. Just say I'd try to do better, I guess. You followed the Kickstarter three years before it released? Kickstarter? There was a Kickstarter? I thought he didn't take any money from anyone until it came out. I never heard of a Kickstarter. I gotcha. Advertised it. Gotcha. I didn't know about Stardew until the day before it came out. I saw someone playing it the day before release and was like, holy shit, I need this. <laughs> A lot of people don't follow that schedule. That is my schedule though, like, that, that's what I'm trying to do. I want to follow that. But, I don't know. I think you might be thinking about Steam Greenlight. That's how I found it. Oh. Well, that's right. We have like a gem thing we can make now. I forgot about that. 10 silver for its raw and jewels. Mm. Need selver. Selena. When are you streaming? Ow! Shit. Stupid gopher dude. Huh. 
Didn't say hi to me. Why would I say hi to you? <laughs> Maybe get a partner badge? True. True, true. Get a partner badge. Then I'll notice you. Num 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 num. Is it weird that I thought that I would I like once I got home I'd be like oh now I don't want to travel for a long time, but I kind of just want to travel again. <laughs> I'm just like I just want to go do another tournament. I'm ready. to tame that down a bit since I'm not going to be going for a while. Vicariously three if that's cool. <laughs> that's cute. I was thinking of posting a vlog on the YouTube channel of the when I went to Delray Beach, but we'll see if I actually do it. I don't know if I have enough footage to make an interesting vlog. Another cutscene? Dude. What up, Cindy? Someone's singing. Singing? What's that? Who's there? Oh, jeez. Just imagination. Stop trying to scare me like that. But they can't see the... Two shoe. You want to sing just now? Is someone over there? A ghost!
Who are you? Who this? Your name's Tushu? Um, I think I've been sleeping for a really long time. What am I supposed to do now that I'm awake? I don't know. What you tell me? <laughs> Rosa. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Rosa. I heard you were talking shit. More cutscenes. Oh, right. This one. Okay. It's mining time. Mining time. Uh, we need another chest. It's time. We needed another one for like a long time now, actually. <laughs> Two chests will take away one strike I have from 2016. Take away a strike? Why did you get a strike? What did you do? You think they take away a strike? I have no clue. Are you worried about the strike? Like, what's going on? Are you, you about to try to get another one? Like, what? DMCA. I'm not sure, but 2016 is a long time ago. At some point, it should just go away, right? Fucking <laughs> <laughs> true every goddamn time. If not, <laughs> not the nip knobs. <laughs> Further deviousness, deviousness. Oh! Nice. Alpaca name! Eh? Alpaca? Chupaca. Okay, sweet. Chupaca. 
Wait, no. Yes. True says yes to Trupaka. Nice. Okay. Trupaka. <laughs> so <dang. laughs> Love that name. <laughs> What's up, Rice? <laughs> They're not ride me. Okay. I'm gonna sell you as soon as possible. Coral mushroom? Looks like oyster mushroom. Coral mushrooms. Oh boy. We need some gold. We're gonna have to, or we need a gold tool. I mean this is gold, but we need a gold tool. Yeah, sprinkler just water the plants for you. Some. Oh my god. No 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 no. It's gonna take a while. Pitfalls. Tread carefully. Find pitfalls in the ground. Fall into them, you'll lose a large amount of stamina and drop several floors down for current location. That well, seems good. Hmm. This music's different, too. And the enemies are different. Ooh. I like this song. Yeah, I dig it. Pitfall! Whee! Oh shit, how much... How many hearts did I have? Now I'm gonna be 12. Food on me. I thought I brought food. Hmm. Oh boy. Less stamina, but it takes stamina to go down too, though, you know? So, I don't know. Let's go for the gold in the wall nodes, basically. Mm, too many hits. I don't want that. I'm trying to get enough gold so I can get the, uh... Oh, I don't know if I have enough to do that guy. Yeah, this I can do. So I want to get the hammer. Because that seems, like, really important now. 36 gold. I wonder how much... I'll try doing this. Go down one more level. Oh. 
don't fall in that. <laughs> Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mm You pass out if you run out of stamina. Lost in paradise in Florida. <laughs> nice. Oh, I can't do that. Pretty soon to start it, yeah. Uh, do, 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 do. This mine is really good, though. I just need a better hammer. There we go. Don't pass out, don't pass out. Okay, we gotta go. I can't hold that. I hit that guy, I died too. Okay, here we go. Another alpaca? No! <clears throat> Tetris vibes. Mmm. Don't I need like 20,000 gold or something to... To... Get the... Tool upgrade? Not gold bars, but like gold like money. Seems kind of spendy. Yo! Thank you, Fortunate Dan! For the four months, appreciate that. How you doing? And 10 gold bars? Good God. Maze game multiplayer? Uh, what can you do? You can like visit other people's towns like in Animal Crossing, right? Like, how does that work? Uh, Pioneers of Olive Town. You can have your characters go to other players' towns as an NPC. You currently cannot go to other players' game and directly interact with them. There's no multiplayer. Got it. And say, what is that even? 
as an NPC. What does it even mean? Whoa, you're a ho ho. What? Hello? Huh? A hobo. Your ass out here. Macaroni. No. Well, also, what is macaroni in a pot have to do with the thing after that? Think about it. Macaroni. No! Why? You got- Ah. Ah. I don't- I don't want my chat. How do I return it? <laughs> Stop! No! God damn it. I'll never eat macaroni the same ever again. Mmm. <laughs> Feeling some macaroni tonight, chat. <laughs> huh? Macaroni making stream? Don't fall on that. Oh my god. I need four more gold. No. 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 Okay, we need one more gold. Can I make some mac and cheese? makes God to your mac and cheese. You should hop in Discord and listen. <sighs> what am I gonna do with you, chat? I'm not following you even though I've been watching your story videos for like a week. What up, love the bond? Yo, yo. What's up? 
Felonia? Felonia? Might need more furnace or ingots, whatever makers, because this is just a lot. Oh shit, these are done. I'll buy some more stuff tomorrow. Out? You want to get timed out? Punk! Alright, fine. Not good. I don't understand. Understand the timeout. Slower pace than Stardew? Yeah, Harvest Moon games are slower paced. But this is a uh, fairly fast paced for a Stardew game. I don't know. Or, sorry, for a Harvest Moon game. <laughs> Stardew game. Some Animal Crossing is a bit similar to Animal Crossing in some ways. Along those lines, there isn't really like a replacement for Animal Crossing. It's such a black sheet, you know? It's just like so different than anything out there. But, uh, there's a good chance if you like Animal Crossing that you'll like this. Place but at a competitor? Sure, yeah. Oh shit, I'm about to pass out. That's fine. I pass out a lot in this game. <laughs> Good thing it doesn't punish you, really. Else I'd be scared to... I'm gonna pass out, but yeah, it doesn't punish me that bad. Yeah, I woke up at 7 a.m. I have full hearts. In fact, one might say... That's interesting. I had no hearts left. I woke up with full hearts at 7 a.m. I mean, I guess I went to sleep, it was like 9 p.m., which normally I don't go to sleep until like 10 p.m., but... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Hmm. And you don't lose any money. This seems like a pretty good option, especially if you're like... in the mine and you're trying to eke out some... every last bit or something. I don't know. Um, Alright, we need to figure out what we're going to plant. It's the 23rd. What can we plant? We have a calendar here. 28 days. And we're on this day. His birthday, Jack. We can give something to Jack. So one, two, three, four, five. Five days after today. So something with five days grow time should be fine. Six days may be a no-go. Hmm. 
Playing a new game side story seasons in Stardew. Sorry, I'm new. Yeah, I do. Um, I play lots of new stuff that comes out. Um, yeah, I don't exclusively play these types of games. What's some recent stuff I've played that wasn't these games? Let me see here. <laughs> nice. Ah. It am. Oh my god. Oh my god, I need more than that. Holy crap. How did you get so many viewers May 20th, 2017? <laughs> That's fun. I'm looking up some specific stuff. Um, I have no idea how many viewers I got, but definitely a raid because that was during uh, a special stream. May 27th, so in this case, May 27th and 28th. Um, because I always do marathons on May 27th. May 27th is a special day for me because it, it, it marks one more year of daily streaming every day. I have the world record for most amount of days streamed in a row. Um, so in 2017, that must have been my, let's see, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Uh, that day specifically, Ruben would have marked, uh, four full years of streaming every single day. So, uh, yeah, a lot of people watching as I passed on into the fifth year of daily streaming and also... Um, viewership was probably high because I probably got raids from, from the last streamer friends that I've made over the years that were like, Oh shit, he's hit four years daily streaming, let's send him a raid. No, I don't give a fuck about Guinness World Records. Not gonna pay for it. As I keep saying and will keep saying over and over to you guys, not gonna do anything until I hit a decade, then I'll talk maybe to Guinness, but honestly, who gives a shit about Guinness? Dumb that I have to pay them. I've been playing this game. This is like our third day playing it. We have probably around 10 hours in this game. How do you stream if you get sick? Yeah, I've gotten sick multiple times, like very sick a few times. Um, just stream. It's not like I'm, I'm, you know, coal mining or something. Like, I just sit at my computer desk and stream. 
One time I was so sick, one of the days when I was sick, I was, I was too sick to get out of bed, so I just grabbed my, well, I already had my laptop on me, because what do you think I'm doing all day while I'm so sick, bedridden? I'm on my laptop just watching shit. So, just opened up OBS on my laptop and did a stream. I either just talked to stream or played a game on, like, addicting games, captured it and talked to stream, used the webcam on the laptop, done. Stream easy. It's not hard to put on a really crappy stream. <laughs> Which is basically what happens if I'm sick or on vacation. I can always do a low production quality stream. And I give myself that leeway or luxury. So every stream doesn't have to be, you know... great looking but I do make a point of it that I have to it has to be me I have to be interacting like talking with you guys and use a, a camera as well although I guess I wouldn't have to use a camera plenty of streamers out there never use a camera but that's just what I've done so I keep doing that there was really any time you really thought about skipping today no not really there's been times where I wouldn't have streamed if I didn't have to. Mostly on vacations and stuff, but... Once I'm live, I mean... It's a good time, so... Yeah, it's definitely been inconvenient a few times, but... Yeah, and you can stream from phone now. Back when I started the daily, I had to use lap a laptop that you couldn't stream from your phone back then. So it was a little bit more annoying and tricky, but now it's super easy, so. Die maker. Minesweeper on White Sand Beach. Pre I've pretty much done something like that before. I've streamed from just like a beach on vacation where I was just playing like random easy game. Well, I had to make sure that I didn't know what else I needed. I need money if I'm gonna get that. I don't have money. Hmm. Hello. Pokemon Go with laptop and backpack. Yeah, that was around the time re when Pokemon Go came. Was around the time people started doing IRL streaming, and that's when the the mobile apps started coming out for live streaming but i i liked using a laptop more because i could get a higher quality stream i did not mean to go here
Hard Star Energy. Yeah, it's like stamina. And... Yeah. If you get hit by an enemy, you lose hearts, which lose stamina. Same thing. But... I need silver for the gem maker. Okay, now we have enough. Okay. I'm trying to get an enough gold so I can get the hammer, but now I need more money. I guess I can go fishing. Mix of energy HP? Yeah. Mostly just energy. Oh, this is a big fish. Oh no, I can't even catch it. Holy shit. Wow. I don't know what fish that was, but there was no way I was catching that. So you can run out of time on that. <laughs> Fishing mini game is really easy. Fishing. Some of that fishing money. I bet you could get money from processing the gems into stuff. Like, I have like raw diamonds I could process. But I need more silver bars to make the gem thing, so we'll, we'll just have to wait on it. We'll do some fishing in the meantime. Try to make some fishing money, I guess. I need sparkling fish. Those are the ones that give me the real money. <clears throat> When's the next Pokemon Snap come out? It's not coming out. Is that, was that April or is that end of March? Because it's end of March right now. I wonder if it's end of April or end of March. Why can't I can't remember. Well, you guys will know. Oh, what the fuck? Big fish. Salmon. April 30th? Dang. Still a month out then. How much time is your interest? Doubt I'm getting that. Oh, <laughs> Kellogg. I need to go to the bathroom. I'll be back in a sec. Give me a minute, chat.
Last time I put it in for review, it only took like 10 minutes for them to confirm it, which is interesting, so. But yeah, it has loyalty badges set up, but the, the ma it maxes out at 24 months. So I have it like, uh, it's like the first, like zero months, meaning right when you get it, zero through one is just an egg as your badge and comments and stuff. And then once you've hit one month, then it's like the feet popping out or whatever. And then two months is the head popping out and then I think it, then it jumps all the way up to six months which is Yoshi I think or is it three months I don't know have to check you can get it the dinosaur I don't understand why people don't get the fishing game. Fishing game is really easy. You should be. I don't have it. <laughs> I gotta give him something special. Paying the big bucks. I don't understand how it works. Blue means go. White means you can go. Red means don't go. Just basically just blue means go. Red means stop. That's it. Stop. Go. Stop. Go. That's it. That's the game. If you go during red, then it's gonna burn through your durability. If you run out of durability, then you don't catch the fish. It's that simple. Although some fish are so easy to catch, you can just hold it down. Now that I've leveled up fishing and have a better rod and stuff. Oops. Yeah. Thanks. I have a sandwich. Big fish. Not getting any sparkling fish though. Some people will want proof of daily streams. I have it. Just blow the stream. There's a, a link that says proof. Goes to Google Drive. There's proof of daily streams. 
But I only update it like once a year around the time of the daily. So, I mean, if you want proof up to seven years daily streaming. I'm not gonna update it like once a month. That'd be stupid. Waste my time. Almost nobody even looks at that anyway, or even knows that there's proof things there. Um, sleep time? Yeah. All that for 3k. Yeah, no, that's not up to date. The emote thing. What did you re why did you remove some of the emotes like the moon emote why does anyone remove emotes to replace them with other ones I only have a specific number of slots ones that do the worst meaning get used the least which you can track get the axe. I really like the moon emote, but just didn't get used. They just have other emotes that do the same job that people used, so it just kind of gotten swept under the rug. I said what, not why. You. I corrected you only because that doesn't make sense. My English is not good. It doesn't work. That's why I said why instead of what. A lot of people on Twitch just say the wrong thing and so I correct them when their English is bad. I have to work with the, with the, what is said, so. Work on that. It's all good. Your English isn't that bad, you know, it's good. But, uh, yeah, if I'm ever saying something different like that, like, it's probably just because I'm trying to make sense of what you're saying.
unless they're talking about a different topic. Like, you know, you, you say... If I go off on a different topic, then I misread what you said. But if it's purely a grammar thing, then it's probably doing it for a reason. Okay. It's Tuesday. Everything's closed. Panini ASMR. And silver. If diamonds. Twenty-three hours. Damn. The gist was saying, yeah. I, I wasn't. I wasn't trying to. I wasn't trying to correct him. I wasn't like, uh, it's why, not what. I was just. When I say things out loud, I'm saying it so I can present it to the class who's watching, right? Everyone else that's watching. So I say it, I, I just kind of casually say it in the right way so that people understand it without kind of just not outing you. You kind of outed yourself by trying to back correct me, basically. <laughs> so, but yeah, I don't, I don't give a shit about grammar. Overrated, yeah. I mean, I get, I get that, like, if everyone stopped giving shit, then things would kind of just spiral out of control, in a sense, in terms of language, eventually. If we never taught proper grammar and <laughs> things get <laughs> very loosey-goosey. But, uh, you know. No, 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 you weren't criticizing me. No, 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 you weren't criticizing me. No, no, no. No, 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 no. That's not what. No, 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 no. no. Raw diamonds, 2k each. Damn. Yo, we gotta get some more. Yeah, we gotta get some more then. Because then that means we'll get... We need more of these uh, diamond processing things. This should be a good money maker for me. and then cook up a fish. Two fish, maybe? What?
too bad. No, no, too bad. Oh god. Mining time. Processing all the wood, though, too. to the mines. Wait, did I bring a rose out? Ooh, gold quality. Can I just... I can eat that straight up? Nice. Looking thick. Maruko? What up? I'm enjoying it. It's been good so far. Okay. 
All right, silver is kind of the name of what we're going for right now. Now. We don't need to kill those guys because they don't give anything valuable enough. So we can just avoid them, basically. Um, I also don't need to mine the rocks that are near the wall because they can't give uh, stairs. But I just did that for that rock because uh, I wanted the silver. Yeah, only one of the rocks there could have stairs. So those can have stairs. This one here cannot, but we'll get the silver. How is a German word for beef, but a French word for farmer took care of the cows? But the rich aristocrat ate beef. Ow! Some double inputs. What's taking double inputs? Oh, your keyboard or whatever, or your phone? Huh. Whoops, that's not what I meant to do. Because I was in the middle of the swing, I didn't take damage. Interesting. <clears throat> Crayfish. Whoa, that quality's insane. This is a Switch game, yeah.
Oh my god. Damn it. I walked right into it. Alright, it was 7 p.m. and it's your hearts left. What do we got? 